So Doc Martens has a collection of winter boots called the Winter Grip. It's basically the original Doc Martens boots, but it's insulated, it's more water resistant, and it has more traction. So the question is, is it worth it over the 1460s, the original Doc Martens? Well, I mean, we're just talking about the winter period. Since I have both, I'll just be giving out my opinions. The leather Doc Martens boots are one of the most popular boots out there. But the issue is, is it good for winter time? Is it good when it snows? The problem is Doc Martin leather boots are too thin and there's no installation. So if you're outside in the snow for too long, your feet is going to start to get cold. We know that snow is water and water and leather do not mix well. Meaning that if you're out too long with your leather boots, it might cause some issues. For example, it can cause water logging, meaning that Sooner or later, your leather will start to crack. Well, all that being said, these are some solutions that people have done in the past. They'll usually use thicker socks, which makes your feet warmer. And then also they'll use some type of leather protectant or some type of leather protection on their boots to make sure that they get a good coat on there. So this is where your winter grips come in handy. Like I said earlier, the winter grips, they're insulated, meaning that they're gonna keep your feet warm they're more water resistant so you can walk around in snow or little puddles and things like that and then also their traction it has more traction it has like this rubberized backing or things like that that would stop you from slipping you know if you fall on ice or if you walk on ice you should be somewhat okay you should have just a little bit more traction whenever you're walking on let's say slippery surfaces my experience of owning the 1460s winter grip i got these when i lived in north dakota during the time north dakota is so cold literally the coldest it got was negative 20 degrees fahrenheit North Dakota, it is freezing, it's brutal there, and it felt like the winters were so long. And these actually, they really helped. They made sure my feet were warm. I didn't have to worry about too much maintenance or anything. The boots were great. Literally, they were made for especially that. And I didn't wear it all the time, but when I did wear them, I knew like these were good. Also, when it came to like the traction and things like that, I was not too worried about that. That was not the reason why. I bought it. And then also I'm not slipping on ice or anything. It doesn't matter what type of shoes I wear. I never had instances where I was like slipping on black ice or anything like that. I usually catch my balance. So I wasn't too keen for making sure I had traction, but it's a good addition. So back to the question, are these worth it? For me, I'll have to say it depends where you live. Simply because of your climate and your environment and things like that. If you're in the cold like how I was in North Dakota, yes, this is totally worth it because North Dakota, for me, it felt like the winters were so long. They were so cold, every day was tough. Just going outside was a hassle sometimes. So yes, this is necessary if you're in those climates, but let's say if you're in California and things like that, necessary, I don't think these are as necessary. And then also let's talk about the price point of it. They're about 20, maybe $30 more than like your average or your other Doc Martens. So yes, I would say if you're out, you have the money for it. This is a great replacement to give your other Doc Martens a break during the winter time. But if you're not in conditions like that, no, it is not necessary. Also, whenever I look at the Doc Martens website, they're like some good looking ones that look good for winter time. So I don't have to pick and choose like, oh, this one, I could only wear this and it doesn't look as good as like, for example, my other Doc Martens boots. They all look good. They're all like in this whole category of its own, which I actually like. I feel like for me, I enjoy that I have them. So anytime that I do put them on, I know exactly what I'm gonna get. I don't have to worry too much about them. So yeah, that's my thoughts about them. If you should get them, if they're worth it, 